can evict me on and on on. Wouldn't you be better off in having a piece of a property that has 350 units that you have? I mean, to be quite honest with you, we're talking with the Capital Square people and the other sponsors. They're getting some pullbacks on rents as well, Jim, for your benefit in that. But they're they're having they're having to go and bring on the attorneys and, and remind the the tenant that hey you have an obligation here you have to pay up which they do they've been able to do that and they're they're having much less um, the multifamily properties we work with they're having much less pullback than uh, I think you're experiencing there in California and for sure it's not rent control or that 25 percent and deduction and all that kind of stuff. So it's just crazy times to be and especially, I think it makes the case for institutional sized properties as opposed to, and don't take offense, the mom and pop size. Don't, don't, don't attack my client base, Gary. <laughs> there are, there are a client base. Your clients are our clients and you know, they'll, they'll consider themselves mom and pop, but they've, they've worked their tail off and now, they have a government interference saying that, you know, because of a virus, an unseen enemy out there, which I liked your posting, is Jim just posted a thing in 1957 about the Asian flu killing way more than the.